My name is Billy Davis, and I live in a little community south of Round Hill, Virginia, called Airmont. I was introduced to bees in 1949. The name of the company uh, is Sustainable Honeybee Program. It involves basically four facets. One is uh, education and training. Uh, one is recruiting and marketing. And then we have what we call our nuke project, which are small colonies that are complete but small, and the queen project program, which basically on how to raise their queen, to, to try to teach people how to raise their own queens in their own area so that their queens can be acclimated and provide the availability of the genetics that they need to help them accomplish that. Part of the problems we're having is the fact that the bees are not acclimated. We're bringing bees in from the outside. Georgia bees coming into Virginia and we expect them to live under Virginia conditions when they're not used to that and they, we don't give them the opportunity to be acclimated. And uh, nature seems to come back and bite us every time we do weird things without thinking it through. So we're trying to train beekeepers to watch your bees, learn what they are doing and work with them and once you do your job will become much easier, your bees will have a better chance to survive. Uh, it's just common sense, practical beekeeping is all it is. We're getting back to what's real instead of what we imagine would it like to be. We're producing queens and have been producing queens for two years basically uh, on a limited basis. And now we're shifting and we're going more into the breeding of the bees and genetics and dispersing the genetics throughout this region as opposed to just producing things uh, to be producing for bottom line because that's not what we're about. It's just a project that needs to be done in our region and no one has stepped forward so we're trying to get it done.